Hi guys, we are going to learn something new that is Flutter. Most of the people may be aware about the Flutter but the people who do not know what is actually the Flutter. Flutter is a technology introduced by Google on May 2017 for developing the hybrid application. The beauty of Flutter is it can be developed the apps like uh, you can develop the apps with the help of flutter for any kind of a screen as you can see this is screen that various kind of application is developed with the help of flutter is an open source framework it is fast productive and flexible you can develop the application of any kind and is some of the things is inspired with the help of uh, you can say html and css kind of things here you we use actually the dart programming language in flutter so here in this video I will teach you how exactly you are going to develop the flutter application before that what you have to do if in case if it is required what you have to do is flutter download okay you can simply download the flutter okay so flutter you can simply download from here and once you download you will get the options for the windows so once you click on the windows you will see this environment you simply download it I have already downloaded it here okay now how we are going to develop the application we require Android studio to develop the flutter application uh, one more thing is there that if you want to compile and create the things for the iOS also it will be better if you start doing it into your Apple laptop as well then it will nice but if you do have a Windows laptop still you can do that so starting with the flutter you have to go to the plugins of Android Studio. If Android Studio is already installed, then you have to go for this uh, plugins marketplace. We are using Android Studio Chipmunk latest version, and you have to type simply here Flutter. Once you type the Flutter, you will give you the option. It will ask you to install the Dart plugin also. So you simply install the Dart plugin, and it will ask you to restart the IDE. The reason behind this that we are restarting the IDE is so that it can show you the option in Android Studio as right now you have not seen that creating Flutter project over here but once it will restart you will have the option of creating the new Flutter project directly so let's this uh, Android Studio to be start over here okay now it says the new Flutter project okay now once you click on the new Flutter project it will ask you the SDK path so as I told you previously that you can download from here I have already downloaded I will just copy this particular folder from my downloads folder to some particular path so it becomes easy for that that when we are doing this thing because your C drive or you can say you should not keep it on the desktop or some places then it will be not quite easy okay so for the temporary basis if we can we would like to put it some path so what I will do I'll open this path copy this path over here and put it over here and here we will have a dart so it has already fetched up in case if you are do not it doesn't work on it so click on next okay it has already taken the path so just simply cancel it what we're going to do click on new and then click on flutter what path we have put it over here so click on here and then click on next and now it will show you the option so what we will do test project if we click on the dart and you want to create the project then it will create the dart console project but we are going to develop the flutter project now once you open this here you will have this new flutter project option you can simply change it what kind of application you want to develop over here what is the path of your local project you can use java objective c kotlin swift what purpose you want to make it okay the mac os option enables uh, in the case of if you want to use for that one for your Apple laptop application if you want to develop so simply go and click on finish link the project idea already exists I maybe have created earlier so I'll just create it as a number one and then click on this one so once I do that it will start creating the flutter project so let's wait for a while meanwhile we can see the more things like it have a multi-platform feature like you can say simply the mobile generally we develop the mobile application with the help of flutter or like earlier you may have developed with the native technology like java and kotlin or you can say into xcode if you have developed with the help of swift and objective c so you can see 
what are the benefits like built for all as one well as a team you can develop and then you have this kind of uh, applications over here there's a lot of companies which have developed the flutter applications as you can see over here reach users on the screen transforms like it has been tested and these are the application which is being developed on the flutter so now we are on the flutter section meanwhile is uploading the indexes we can get to know more about this so these are all applications supported for the google to open source app environment so this is the helpful thing about the flutter that you develop once and you can do it various way now in my upcoming videos you will be seeing i will tell you those things which generally you will not find it anywhere in a sequence wise to learn the flutter so now on the left side you can see it here the project explorer which have the see ios is there and then in the library and then you have android it's just like if you know about android and everything the main thing is here these are all explorer details over here so that's all in this video guys i'll in the next video i'll show you what are the files and features available into this uh, application of flutter and how we are going to develop the application so this is a very simple application if you run it it is a small package over here so in the next video we will see how we can go ahead with the flutter so see you guys in the next video and guys please subscribe my channel to get the latest video on the latest technology and learn the great things See you, bye.